Hey there, and welcome to Capacity Middle East Extra, powered by JSA. That's us, JSA, and I am Dean Perrine, and we are coming to you live on location at the beautiful, it is a beautiful hotel, isn't it? Is it is a beautiful at hotel. At the beautiful Hyatt Dubai, and I am here with the very tall, <laughs> the, the, the very tall Mr. Carl Roberts. Carl is a partner at Hedera Consulting. Carl, thanks so much for taking the time to speak with us today. Well, Dean, thanks for inviting me. It's always a pleasure to do a, a gig with JSA. <laughs> it is a gig, kind yeah. of, right? It is. But, uh, whether, Carl, it, whether it's long or short, by the way. Yeah, we'll, we'll try to <laughs> we'll keep this one kind of in the middle of long and short. But for our viewers that don't already know, Carl, why don't you tell them a little bit about Hedera Consulting? Well, look, Hedera Consulting has been going since 2015. It's my own consulting company. And, uh, you know, I've been in, in this industry or the ICT industry for getting close to 40 years. Up until now, I've been saying... 35 in a bit, but it's nearer 40. So you started when you were three. So I started when I was three, and uh, uh, you know, half of that has been in the telecoms industry. Mm -hmm. So uh, I used to run uh, Verizon's international carrier business. So uh, with all the experience and white hair that goes with that, I now <laughs> provide counsel and advice to C-suites of carriers, and it's an exciting time because everything's going digital, everything's going software, transformation is everywhere it in is. every little detail yeah, yeah. of everywhere and there's a lot of work and experience counts and whilst the technology is brilliant and can do everything it's also about organizations and people changing the way they do things so it's fascinating and you know people often say to me why do you still do this i say it's because i love it i love the people and it's really exciting and experience does indeed count it does um yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, we're going to go off script immediately, oh, Carl. Perfect, perfect. I'm, just, I'm just letting you know now. Because we, when we talk about digital transformation, and it does, it's like the top down, the, the bottom up, it is, it is in every single thing that we do. But in order to really fully understand the implications of that, it takes history, some, some hindsight. Yeah, it, it takes history, it takes hindsight, it takes, you yeah, know, it's great to know what works. Knowing what doesn't work is also important yeah. because you avoid mistakes. Uh, and also mapping that experience to what today's technology brings is fascinating. And I find it really interesting. And what I find actually quite fun is when you look at me and you look at some of the people I have on the other end of a Zoom <laughs> uh, who are a lot younger, I find I'm saying, come on, you've got to move forward yeah. and do things differently. So that's what I find that's great. And that's what's great about a show like this because... Over the past couple of years, and particularly since COVID kicked yeah. in, uh, that caused an acceleration of digitalization yeah. of everything. And a, a lot of operators got caught a little bit short because their planning was on a longer timeline. Mm -hmm. So now everything's in a rush. So that's broken down a lot of traditional barriers about uh, cooperating with you know, operator to operator, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. operator to hyperscaler to internet exchange, to data center players, and also to software companies who are bringing in these new value-added functions that give us a very new world, which is on-demand, consumers, you won't pay for what you consume, and that's a very different world from the one that we've come from. Yeah. I want to hire you right now. <laughs> that, okay, that, that's, 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 that's good. So Done. Done. <laughs> so, um, look, there is a reason that you are, you have been called the champion of this event. Um, and I think a lot, of, a lot of that reason was just kind of spilled out onto this table. But what does that mean to you? Well, being a champion, well, it's very humbling, but I think there are many champions of this event. But I love this event because... Okay, it's called Capacity Middle East. I'd say in name only. Mm -hmm. It happens to take place in the Middle yeah. East, but it's got Middle Eastern carriers, African carriers, Europe many European carriers, lots of Asian carriers, a few American carriers mm -hmm. also, and actually some folks from Latin America. So this is it's a very global. Glo it's a global event. Yeah. Each year it's growing, and it's uh, I've often said it's early uh, earlier it's early enough in the year so that conversations you have here can actually bear fruit within the year because as you go further down the year you're talking about starting initiatives that will bear fruit next year yeah. here you've got an opportunity in the first half to do something that gives you a kind of kicker and a, mm -hmm. and a start this year and and also as you've seen the place is a buzz i mean there's a it's great crazy right great now. vibe yeah. here 
and everybody's upbeat. In years gone by, you, know, you go from enthusiasm to troughs, and for a number of years there was a trough. Yeah. You know, COVID was challenging times, and we didn't have events like this. We did them online, and you know, kudos to the capacity team for doing that. But now that people are back together, it's like there's an extra two or three gears in That's the right. gearbox. You can feel it. And you can feel it, yeah. and everything's... You know, going forward at a, a, a thousand miles an hour, and that's why I'm proud to be a champion of this event because I just think it's great. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, I, I can feel your your passion, your compassion, your energy yeah. for the event and for uh, the trans the transformation that's happening uh, within the greater industry. Yeah. And um, I, I I see why people. Um, <laughs> call you the champion and why you say experience counts. We really appreciate your time today. Thank you. Okay, well, look, my pleasure and it's great and enjoy the, the rest of the event. I intend to do that. Thank you very much, Carl. Okay, thank you, Dean. You Bye. bet. And thank you, viewers, for tuning in. We'll see you soon. Thank you.